together. It's so exciting. My name is Vasi. I'm a part of FedPix Academy. And today I have the amazing Jennifer, I have Leslie and I have Bobby who are very passionate and I'm very thankful to Jennifer for inviting me to be again part uh, uh, and just to be able to share the story more about post in the city and especially I don't know about you but I'm so excited that uh, you know post in the city it's just in few weeks it's like I feel that I will go to sleep and tomorrow will be time for a lot of fun and celebration <laughs> and as you know each of you, Jennifer, she is the founder of Celebrity Catwalk. She's very special and amazing person. I'm very honored to call her my friend. And for all of us, we know that she gives her heart to each of us. She makes this post in the city one of oh. the best, I would say the best uh, event of the year. Uh, and it's just so much fun. Fun. And of course, we have Leslie. She's uh, amazing. You know, she said yes. We will come. I will come and share with you my cutie patootie. We'll talk about having fun, walking on the runway, and we have Bobby. Such an honor for her to be here with us and join. My cutie us. patootie's so, growling. <laughs> oh, of course. Listen, Chico is the, in the other room. That he's my boy, and he's like, you know, saying, say, "Oh, by the way, he." Like matching bow with your background, Leslie. This is awesome. <laughs> this is fantastic. You know, I'm known for this. Oh, you know? <laughs> oh. Puccini said, I am not getting paid to do this. He <laughs> needs to speak to his union representative. I get it. Sorry, I, I get won't it. Keep up. You see, I Bobby wasn't even up. gonna try to get her girls. She said, "We're not. This isn't a paid gig." They're down here watching. <laughs> there you go. Oh, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. Well, Jennifer, thank you for having us. Oh, thank You're you. So excited. Thank you. I think that it's it's no accident that having Leslie and Bobby with us together tonight, they are original pause in the city models. So they were there at the beginning. They were there in 2013. They were there when it began. As we all know, it'll be 10 years in 2023. So it really is one, they can, they can really give the good, the bad and the ugly. I should probably, you know, close my ears because they can really speak. They, they've been through what I like to affectionately call, you know, slave ship conditions <laughs> in terms of, of dressing rooms. They have really been there through what I like to call the good, the bad, and the ugly and seen us grow. And they they were there, they've been there since the beginning. <laughs> I actually sent Vassy some blackmail photos of that. <laughs> there you go. I'm going to show some. <laughs> I'm going to show them. Believe me. It, it, it's amazing. Oh my God. It, it's so incredible to hang out with you ladies and, you know, just to kind of. I don't know about for the people who are joining us now live and later we'll be watching uh, or listening the podcast, Pepix Academy podcast, but I know that it's such an honor to see, mm -hmm. you know, Pulse in the City, Celebrity Catwalk from a slightly different angle. You know, <laughs> to see kind of really to hear the story, how everything started, right. you know, like right, you right. Had this amazing friendship for so many years and it's just awesome. Yes, these ladies have seen, as they say, how the sausage gets made. So they yes. have, yes, they have been since the beginning. Like Leslie said, she's got some good blackmail photos. I'm sure if Bobby was hard pressed, she could come up with some as yeah, well. So they have really, they have been hitting the catwalk with us from from the mm -hmm. beginning. And Leslie is extremely active, as I think I mentioned to you, Vasi. She is a former rocket, or I should probably say present rocket, because once a rocket, always a rocket. Oh, there you go. Yes. Bobby, <laughs> I'm thrilled to have Bobby is an event producer in her own right. And I puppy prom, I'm always asking and stalking her about puppy prom. She just it's did coming. a big it's Halloween. Coming. She did a big Halloween this, just this past weekend in the Bronx yes. where she oh. rides. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. So these ladies have a lot, they, they have a lot of, they spin a lot of plates 
wow. throughout the year as it is, <laughs> but they still find time for, for us. So I'm very, very grateful for that. <laughs> That's amazing. And it's incredible. In fact, uh, I just want to also say hi to the Instagram community. Uh, currently, friends, I'm very honored. I am on Celebrity Catwalk fa uh, Facebook page. Uh, and I'm having a lot of fun with Jennifer, <laughs> who is the founder of Celebrity Catwalk. Also, Leslie Ryder, Puccini's mommy, and also with Bobby Mitchell. So we are going to have a lot of fun talking about Celebrity Catwalk, mm -hmm. how everything started, uh, and just learning a lot of things from the history of Celebrity Catwalk. <laughs> I'm so excited, you know, and it's amazing. How do you find time, you know, like, because now Celebrity Catwalk, it's... Uh, and uh, also, uh, you know, Glam Sisters, Mommy says, you know, sending you kisses from Instagrams. You know, <laughs> it's really, it's amazing how all the, you know, podcasts and all the platforms are just, you know, connecting. But yeah. thank you. We miss you too. And, you know, we are happy to see you there. So are you excited, lady? Because Celebrity Catwalk, Pause in the City, it's honestly in a few weeks. Yeah. <laughs> it's like two and a half weeks, three weeks. Almost you don't here. think about it. You don't think about it. You just, you don't think about it until the day before. And then you're like, oh, oh my God, I got to pack this, 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 this. I forgot to I get on an airplane. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the day before is when you think about it. Yeah. 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 We used to not have to go get on an airplane, but it's okay. Yeah. Yeah. I would yeah. go get on an airplane. Yeah. All, okay. All good. Awesome. Do you okay. have a list? I'm curious. Do you have a list must take? So you make sure that you don't, uh, you know, forget something because you have a lot of things to carry with you. So many outfits. My, and... On my list, as long as all of Cece's clothes, because that's actually, that's all that's going to fit in the suitcase. And I can bring <laughs> maybe one dress and whatever I'm wearing. That, that's basically it. It's because she's, she's got maybe like 20 outfits. And nice. they all have to go in the suitcase. Oh. And, it's like, and, now, and I'm kind of scared. It's like, I'm going to put some in the suitcase and some on the carry on. And because ah, I have to check the suitcase because I have I can't carry a carry on to put the clothes in because I have yeah. to fit my clothes in there too. So I'm checking the suitcase and I'm putting half of her stuff in the carry on just to be safe. <laughs> yes. And heaven forbid they lose a luggage, you know. Yeah, exactly. That's why that's why half of it is going yeah. in, in the carry on. That's yeah. Very yeah. Smart. yeah. <laughs> this is a great idea. So it's so funny because I, you know, uh, this is actually really great, you know, golden nuggets. Friends, for those of you who are going to be traveling, that's fantastic split. The outfit mm -hmm. really yeah. makes pure sense. I mean, yeah. I drove, but if I had uh, the outfits your babies have, I still wouldn't be able to fit them in my car, <laughs> even if I drive an SUV. But I really love this is a great tip. Yeah. You know, so if you travel, split the clothes. The outfit, so you. you still have something for the for your baby to wear just in case they happen to lose your luggage. Yeah. Wow. Yes, that's great. Oh, one of the other women I'm I'm uh, traveling with, she said to me, oh, by the way, Leslie, um, I'm bringing an empty suitcase for us so that we can bring back all our raffle wins. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay, that. that's a good idea. <laughs> Better idea, have it shipped. Better idea, oh, have it shipped oh, back. Oh, yeah, Jennifer does that free. That's right, free of there service. you go, there you go, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> And Leslie has a lot to take. She, Puccini often has signature bow ties and yeah, matching but outfits. Like the girls' things, you know. Exactly, exactly. Right. She has a lot to to schlep as well. So <laughs> good, I like good Bobby. tips. <laughs> I, I think you win, Bobby, for that one. That's a lot of outfits, and they're big but, ones. I know with the girls. Yes, yes. yes. Yes, I mean, Puccini's little like outfits, you know, me. they're like little, little diaper <laughs> outfits here. You know? <laughs> my clothes, I can roll. Yeah, I can't right. roll her outfits. No. I have to no. lay them flat. I can't roll her stuff. Right. I can roll my pants. I can roll my t-shirt. Her stuff has to lay flat. Yeah. The deep. You know, the deep. Yeah. 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 Amazing. <laughs> That's amazing. We have new people who are popping in on Instagram. Hi, friends. So oh. nice to see you there. We are currently, I'm with my friends. Uh, we are talking about Celebrity Catwalk, which is uh, an incredible pet fashion fundraising event in South Carolina. It used to be in New York. Uh, Jennifer is the founder 
Uh, and there is a show in a couple of weeks from now, and we have also Leslie Ryder and Bobby Mitchell, who have been supporters for a long time. And we're talking about all these amazing outfits, which about 20 are for kids, how you <laughs> transport them. Because this is, I mean, this is a big deal. I mean, mm -hmm. everything what I saw when I came, it's like they're really nice, they're beautiful, but also you have to kind of figure out a way on how you're going to, you know, bring them without really damaging them. You yes, know, yes. so I do agree. And in fact, I actually would like here oh, to share, oh. you know, you send me some pictures, right? So every time <laughs> when you send me pictures, and I'm really so sorry, friends, again, if you like, you can come and join us in a, we are right now on Facebook. If you go to Pet Peaks Academy Paparazzi Group, you can find us there. Uh, uh, because I share, but we on Celebrity Catwalk Facebook page. Uh, and I just want to show you here when it decides to work. So, you know, we have Bobby <laughs> Mitchell and this is the beautiful girl she has. Uh -huh. right. yep. <laughs> this <laughs> is time. a great, look at this. Look at this. Look at that. The baby. baby. Look. Look. You've got some Mary Serrano mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. Jan Ben. Very mm -hmm. exciting. Our okay. Moroccan designer, Jan Ben. And yeah. is that Ashley Dawn Alega up there, Young Bobby? Alega, yeah. Yeah. I think so, yes. Yes, and Ashley yeah. Dawn. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Wonderful, yeah. who we interviewed Vasi a couple yes. weeks ago. Yeah, we did, yeah, we did, yeah. It's, yeah, it was really great. And I interviewed, we you know, both of them, they came on Pet Picks Academy podcast as individual um you know a podcast episode so they're very talented you know it's like really amazing and they're, those are kind of a small outfits i mean you can see the one here on the on the left it's like yeah like that's it's, a kathy uh, weston gown yeah, yes. and who did the short red lace one uh, don't, don't start me to lying uh, yeah. is that is that <laughs> <laughs> i think i know this is kathy weston <laughs> I want to say that maybe Mary Serrano also in the short red. It could be. It could be. I may be. I may be. Yeah, I'd have to get up to look. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. It's just more Mary. Ashley Dawn, more Mary Serrano. All right, Mary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we have, and then we have here some more. I mean, it's it was like so hard because I'm like, okay, I need to showcase some of them. Look at these. Yes. Guys. And <laughs> lots of these photos were taken by very talented Revy Simmons, yep. mm -hmm. Revital, Claw and Paw Photography. Shout out mm -hmm. to Revy. She's a wonderful photographer. Mm -hmm. And she took some of these great shots, Vasi, that you have included. So thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, of course. Thank you to her. She's very talented. I had the opportunity to meet her in person. She's a very sweet person. She is like adorable and uh, like she's talented. I just this think that, yeah, ah! great. look at this. There now. we go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, All right yes. <laughs> Do you remember there those days? Go. Look at that, Leslie. Look at those that. Are at the beginning of time. That was that was is that, wait, the beginning. That one was, Leslie was took that us one in back. The, in the um, hotel? No, it wasn't the hotel. On How you met? Yep. That yeah. far one on the left with yes. Puccini for Christmas. That yes. was one of the first ones at the Cal you met photography yes. studios. Yes. Yes. Exactly. Yes. Yep. Oh. That was such <laughs> a pretty. All you guys did such nice decorating for Christmas. Oh. And that was one of the first stages there at Calumet in the yes. middle. Yes. Um, yes. And that was one of your infamous grass photo backgrounds. Yes. I love, <laughs> I love the it. grass. Yes. <laughs> I love that. I love it. Love it, Leslie. You guys look fabulous. <laughs> what well, amazing, you know, it's just so amazing to see like your story. You know, oh, look at like, these. Amazing. So the one on the far left there, Puccini in the little velvet pink bow. This month, he's been honoring all the breast cancer. Uh, it's been Breast Cancer Awareness Month, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which uh, his mommy is uh, one of those, unfortunately. Oh. So, and also, that is by 21 Bays, a Pups, that little bow. And she has donated some for our raffles for Celebrity Catwalk this time. And I'm real happy about that. She's mm -hmm. such a wonderful woman. Mm -hmm. And that one there in the middle is super cute. 
And I have that right here also, and that's by Rhonda Dasher. Woo, shout out to yes. Rhonda Dasher. Beautiful <laughs> <laughs> outfit there. Not big like Bobby's, but it's super <laughs> <laughs> And then that one on the right is, Bassie, I know you were interested in that. I was telling her about how Jennifer comes to the city and we do little television uh, promos. Mm -hmm. Yeah, gotta get that going again in 2022. Yes, exactly. And that was one of the uh, directors. Yes, with Gia. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's amazing. What a beautiful, like it's so, what I'm fascinated by is that every picture has a story, it brings a memory. And mm -hmm. also, you know, the designers, I mean, honestly, bravo to the yeah. designers. Because Absolutely. they are giving, and thank you for the love of everyone. They are putting their soul and heart. And as an artist, you know, I'm a true believer and I keep repeating myself, each of us, we are artists in our own ways. Mm -hmm. And so you may create clothes, you may take pictures or do art, you name it, bandanas, bows. And the end of the day, what really unites us, mm -hmm. you know, is passion and love for our furry babies. And mm -hmm. just, uh, it's amazing. I mean, it's amazing what each of you uh, do and the rest of the supporters of uh, post in the city, like donating their time, going, having fun. It's a community, it's a, it's a lifestyle. Mm -hmm. and, and for those of you friends who are watching this or listening, and, and you don't know what it's post in the city, honestly, through the pictures and to what you know Leslie and Bobby are sharing with you, you have to going to understand that this is a really a fun place to be. Mm -hmm. And I do, by the way, have to make a comment. I do like the giveaway, like the auction items. Like I remember I went there, there were like, I don't know, five, six tables with auction items. And I'm like, I want to get this purse. I want to get, get <laughs> yeah. it. Yeah. It's so much fun, you know? And it's, uh, it's amazing. It's just really, really incredible to see it. Like everyone combining forces uh, in a great way, we can achieve so much. But again, without Jennifer. Oh, thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that. I think that's that's your Deborah Stevens, isn't it, Leslie? Yes, those little overalls are by Deborah Shout Stevens. Out to Deborah. So cute. My little farmer boy up there in the corner. And then yes. that one in the middle is Jan uh, Ben. Jan ben. Oh, but wow. I wanted to put that one up because Jennifer has these really nice outdoor shoots. Mm -hmm. Also, oh, her apartment, yes. They're so nice. I always love those. And that one leaning up against the tree, that was a bag that Judy White had made me and embroidered Puccini's name on it and made one of his signature big bow ties. And it's, <laughs> it's just adorable. And Crystal had taken that picture. And yes, shout out to Crystal <laughs> Rojas. Yes, yes. <laughs> black and white, it's just so nice. Yes. I love the contrast there. It's a very classic photo. It's really great. It is, it's timeless. It's a timeless, yes. picture, you know, and here it's uh, the tip, as you know, I like to always to give tips. It's oh. when you take a picture and you convert it in black and white, removing the color, you bring the emotion. Mm -hmm. That's yes. why you can have yeah. the same two pictures in color and black and white. And the black and white, when you see it, you start going to remember to feel it. And mm -hmm. the color, it's really nice. So nice to see you, you know, hi there, hi Lisa. Uh, it's just amazing, you know, that's what it is. It's just amazing. So what's the story for this outfit? So I this, love it. That's Darlene Hatchie. Darlene. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yes. Can someone get Darlene on the line. <laughs> Darlene. Yes. Darlene, that, where are you? I mean, I'm like, today we had a discussion, her and I. She's like, Leslie, do you think that bow tie is a little big for him? And I'm like, no. It's perfect. You know, the bigger the better. It, it's so pretty. She just like went out on a limb this time. Like, Honestly, I've never done anything like that. She put flannel on the inside. That's she nice. Put bows and blings and beads and you name it, it's on here. And it's, so nice. it's great. It's going to be a nice, actually, a nice winter vest for Big Boy, mm -hmm. you know, a right, stylish right. one. I love it. I love it. Well, anyway, that was a lot of fun. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> he knows well, I love those big bow ties. <laughs> I love the big bow ties. They're really, really amazing. Oh, wait, wait. So, okay, go back. Go back to, uh, I'm, I'm insisting about Leslie. Oh, when, no. 
Well, they do shows. Yeah, because see, I have to, I have to say this, Leslie. Whenever they're doing the fashion shows and we're backstage and the parents are like, oh, okay, okay, the dog is dressed. You see how she has all these different outfits to match her dog? Mm -hmm. That's a pro. Oh. Bobby has one outfit, a <laughs> Leland black dress. I'm to the point where as long as I can get the dog dressed, I'm not trying to get the dress at the same time. They're backstage. Oh, give me this, give me this. You see the dog is dressed and they're putting on all these outfits and the hats. And, the, and I'm just sitting there looking at them like, okay, keep going. Here's my little black dress. And I just yeah. keep going. Let me tell you, that little black dress is perfect. I got one of those two right there in the middle. I love it. But they Maybe always seem to match. I mean, I think it's wonderful. I wish I could do it. I give them props, but that will never be me. You come stand saying. by me. I'll get you naked and redress. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. It's uh and, and, and I can completely understand, like you under pressure. I mean, friends uh, uh it's like when you go to post in the city and then you can see so it's a huge room uh mm -hmm. and uh they're kind of divided by little stations and you know every furry parent you can see they have like a big hanger with like 20 25 outfits i'm not <laughs> exaggerating truly the 20 to 25 but they also don't forget they go together with accessories so like mm -hmm. when you go there i myself i'm like from beautiful to actually beautiful to uh, exceptional i'm like i have no idea i mean again bravo to the designers and, and then you know everything is happening so super fast that you know you have to go in and keep dressing your furry babies uh and it's just really emotional but you don't really have time to dress i mean i really have no idea how you can dress your baby and also go and change your outfit so i admire you but do you know what at the end of the day what i truly believe that of course, putting so much time and effort and everything, it's fantastic. But the fact that you are there, that you made everything what you could to participate and join, I think that this is what is the most important. Because, you know, some people may say, oh, maybe it's not for me. Oh, you know, I maybe I'm, a, I'm sh uh, shy. I don't want to, you know, walk on the wrong way. Well, to me, it looked like everyone had a lot of fun when they were walking. But again, <laughs> it's about this amazing, special bonding time with your furry baby on the stage. Mm. That's what it is. It is. And yeah. just doing something so much bigger and greater, raising money for rescue. How yeah. awesome is that? You know, how <laughs> awesome? Yay. Yay. Mm. Oh, Very yeah. nice. And so the question for me... Huh? ladies is so let's can i just ask first leslie so leslie like approximately do you know how many outfits uh you know uh, your boy has for now which is and she still has more coming actually oh my god oh, look at that oh my god okay one two three <laughs> let's see how many i'm separate uh this so we can see here <laughs> i'm gonna say roughly like maybe 16 yeah that's a lot. Does that sound about right, Jennifer? Something in <laughs> yes, that? Yes, yes, yes. Well, 16 outfits. Do you imagine 16 one of a kind outfits? I think you probably still need a bigger house. <laughs> My apartment is this size to begin with. Wow. <laughs> Chini has, oh, yes, I'm so sorry. He's got, um, <laughs> I, he's grouchy tonight. I'm right. telling you, this is an unpaid gig. He wants to know <laughs> what is going on. Yeah. Well, it's dinner time too. Oh. It, uh, <laughs> dinner. Men, men. <laughs> He's got a three carry-on suitcases filled with his little things. And then I have some Tupperware doodads that I put his uh, wow. accessories, bow ties, leash, you yes. know, all that yes. little, little stuff in. Yes. One time, Vasi, you'll have to bring these ladies back and everyone back because you see that Leslie mentioned Tupperware. Um, Bobby mentioned the, the labels. I think that all the models have these incredible yes. hacks yeah. that they yes. use yeah. to kind of, there's yeah. a method to the madness of what they do to keep themselves together yes. and sane. Huh. And, sane. And just organized. sane, not together, just sane. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll say, yes. What you just taught me tonight, you should even teach the designers. If they don't have yeah. a label, just yeah. put one of those thingies in there. Yeah. The, just, labels. the best, right. the best designer hack. Hold on, hold on. I have to show these to designers. Okay. Look at this, this is the designer. Best designer <laughs> hack for people who have clothes and you Thank don't know you. where they you got them from. Get this little tiny labels, write the designer names, stick it in the back of the clothes. That's yes. Amazing. Look That's at it. This. No label. No label. I love it. Look at it. That's really great. That's fantastic. Well, so I, I do know, Jennifer, I think, uh, and hi to everyone who is jumping now again in Instagram. Uh, I think that those are fantastic tips and tricks. We definitely will. I will, we and I will set something, but as right now today, the two amazing gifts are split your luggage on two. Yes. Mm. Also make sure, so if it, anything, God forbid something happens and hi, hi, get mm -hmm. lost, you have second set of clothes. Mm -hmm. Add mm -hmm. the sticky with the name of mm -hmm. the designer if they yes. didn't add the name. Well, mm -hmm. there is another one. And actually my very different uh, uh, Lisa, she's from New York Girls. Uh, I actually released her podcast episode today. She travels a lot. Mm -hmm. yeah, I love her. Things. We had lunch a couple weeks ago. Really? Yeah, oh, yeah, I love her. So <laughs> yeah. So it's what she said in the podcast episode, uh, uh, one of the goodies, and again, I encourage everyone to listen. It's in Pet Picks Academy podcast and uh, Apple podcasts and our website. But what she said was, if you're traveling and if you need, you can ship food to the place you're yeah. going so yes. if you cannot carry with you so exactly. much mm -hmm. you can definitely do it and another really mm -hmm. very value so thank you so much to her for this goodie mm -hmm. and another great value and she's sending the kisses you we love it. and i listen oh. when you talk <laughs> us in the podcast i listen and another value tip she mentioned was that she encouraged for the our babies to get used to the little you know like uh, carry on back Mm -hmm. So they know that this is like their home and also mm -hmm. to have like a comfortable, like a, the favorite blanket. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. this way, anywhere you go, they can feel comfortable. So thank you mm -hmm. again so much, you know, to Lisa for those great tips. Right. And again, she has a book, you can go and check it out. But those tips are fantastic. Right. Really yeah. great. Right. Uh, oh, and then, one more tip. Yes, one more tip. Please. Carry oh. extra Velcro. Mm -hmm. Carry oh, extra fun. Velcro. Yes. Great. This is well, great and me for safety pins. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I need those oh, the pins for putting yeah. the bow ties together. Right. right. That no, no, that's a great. Do you know what I actually talking about this? Let me show you here my tip. You know, I always like pet picks to give tip. So do you see those are like the little wires? Nothing fancy, like uh -huh. cables. Well, I use it for everything. So, like, let's say, like, look at this. Cable wire? Yeah, a little yeah. cable wire. You know, like when you get to the cables and you, yeah. have, you see when inside it's with a yeah. wire. And mm -hmm. so what I would do now, this is a very nice bow from Fur Drop. Wow. I will go and I will kind of tie it. And mm -hmm. also, I, mean, I don't have here. Oh, no, no, listen. <laughs> talking about stuff <laughs> when people send me i collect them i have a special so this is from maggie and co and so like let's say so you can just kind of use whatever you're doing right right and so i'm not I don't don't judge me now it's not the best but, <laughs> but i will take this wire and i can just kind of do it and it's soft oh, so right. no one yeah. can see it right right yeah. and especially for pictures Mm, right you know so whatever like now it's not the best but so you can right. definitely you know do a lot of things and the same with you know uh bow ties and again you have nice one you know this is the crappy one <laughs> before i enter the fashion one no, no, this, yeah so yeah. this is uh look at this look at, so i would actually kind of do i will tie it that's a good idea because sometimes yeah. the bow ties are too big for Puccini, yeah. and those you could actually make it smaller yeah. if you looped up the wire. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So those yeah. are kind of some of my, you know, tips and tricks. To be honest, right. you. You know, <laughs> so much more to learn. And I do have little clips here somewhere. They're like from one dollar store. So I use them when I do my sessions and when I do like the outfits. It's a little big for picture purposes. Yeah, uh, that's what you know I typically would use and just clip it. 
So at least from right. the angle for pictures. But of course, you're going on the runway, so it's slightly different. You know, yeah. those tips are as well. Slightly different. <laughs> yes, uh, exactly. Yes, and you know, you can come and join us, of course, in uh, you know, Celebrity Catwalk. The way you can see it, uh, Facebook page. Uh, and mm -hmm. by the way, you know, there were some comments that ah, oh, but let um, just give me a second. There is a really nice comment. I always bring Gu. Uh, for you know, for the balls, I think that's really great, and uh, they also like the ideas we gave. Uh, but you know, really, just think about of the box when I have kind of the emergency kit, so I always make sure that I have this with me. Mm -hmm. uh, for yeah. you know, you never know, you know, you never right. know, but it's really awesome. And then for people who cannot make it, I know that there's still some available uh, spots for people if you they would like to join now, the November. It's you can there there are guest tickets available. You can oh, wow. absolutely attend the event and you can get tickets at celebritycatwalk.com. Model registration is happening now for May. Mm -hmm. We have, I'll do a post this week. We have 20 models already signed up for May of 2022. Oh, wow. Designers like to start very early. For instance, some of our international designers and, and, and the models know this. I am waiting for designs and designs come up until the day of the show. Mm -hmm. So oh. designers need as much time as yeah, they can yeah. possibly get. So they are actually chomping. I have, I have designers who have asked me for the early bird models for 2022 now, because, you know, for some designers, they may have full-time jobs. They have children, they have grandchildren, they have other things going on. Being a designer in Paws in the City is truly a labor of love, just like the models do it. It's a lot of work. It's, it's a labor of love for the designers. So they have to squeeze in doing their designs in between all the other things that they have going on. Yeah. So they are actually starting now to work on May, 2022. So mm -hmm. I'm always, it, it's like Groundhog Day. So <laughs> as soon as literally the day after the show wraps, we are starting on 2022 and really not really, we've already kind of started on 2022 mm -hmm. with some of our designers, particularly uh, uh, Mary Devankovic, our Israeli designer. She needs a little bit of time. And as everyone can imagine shipping, oh, there you go. You shipping is a bit of a beast from Israel as it is. So <laughs> it it takes a while. So we, we're constantly, so I say all that to say, Vasi, that model registration for May is going on now and it will end in November. November. Okay. So that, that that's really great information. So friends, if you'd like to be a model, as sooner as better, because again, there is only certain amount of models you can have. Uh, and, uh, and so it's kind of truly, it's limited. Uh, it's yes. kind of limited spots available. Uh, and also, if you want to participate as a guest, just to see it, again, you can go to celebritycatwalk.com mm -hmm. and you can get tickets. Also, I want to remind that if you have a pet business and would like to be a vendor, you can definitely be a vendor because I, that's how I went as a vendor. Uh, and it was <laughs> fantastic. You know, it was fantastic. And then, you know, you can go now and then this way. You can go in May because they are in May and November. If this is your first time meeting Celebrity Catwalk, uh, you know, there are two editions. It's May, typically like third week of May, uh, and uh, and we, it's also November, mm -hmm. like a second week of November. Of course, they are the, the exact date, but that's kind of top of my head. And uh, <laughs> there were some people that, let me see, I feel like it's hard uh, for the male pups to dress up and get attention. Well, what I saw not, here, and then oh, look at this, no, let me show you. No, it's not. Okay. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. I get some really cute stuff. Ginny's mom. It's, uh, you know, it's uh, it's beautiful. Look at the, oh, this is. Aiden Nieves, Aiden Nieves. Oh, and baby. does we have, we have, yeah. we have several designers, Denise Lucas, Aiden Nieves, yes. Darlene Hatchie, Danielle Purcell, Julie Lancaster. Most of our, 
I understand the concern that the girls get a lot of the shine, but we have a tremendous amount of designers and, and Leslie is demonstrating that show that the boys are, are definitely catching up. Mm -hmm. don't, yes, they are. don't say that, Victoria Melnick. Mm -hmm. So please don't be discouraged. The, the boys are definitely holding their own and Deborah Stevens, they're really getting it together. So don't, if, if you're a guy and you want to come and hit the catwalk, we would love to have you. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, the guys are still being represented. Mm -hmm. Rhonda Dasher, I, I'm going to, I'm going to say that three quarters of mm -hmm. our designers do boys and girls. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you all three quarters. Wow. Three quarters. Chris Bryson. That's Chris mm -hmm. Bryson. Yeah. Don't mm -hmm. don't say that. That's a mm -hmm. that's a myth. We're we're trying to we're trying to break the glass ceiling for the boys. <laughs> we're, we're we're breaking through. We're breaking through. We're trying to change that that stereotype. Yeah. And and we have quite a few designers who really represent beautifully for the boys. Yeah, yeah. No, and I I mean I had the opportunity to see them uh, in life, you know, the <laughs> outfits and and keep seeing them all the time because of you know Facebook and Instagram mm -hmm. and. It doesn't matter a boy or, or a girl. I mean, they are vest and the clothing. Oh my God, they are stunning. I mean, I'm 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 truly it's official fact. I'm jealous. I'm like, <laughs> I want to be dressed this way. And you know, and I see really a lot of cute uh, boys who are really like so well dressed. It's just really like it's really amazing. You know, mm -hmm. it's just so amazing. It's to see you know the boys dressed, the girls dressed. And in fact, yeah, I yeah. mean, like. And they have fun, you know, some people, uh, you know, they may say, oh, I don't like to dress my furry babies. And so nice to see you. Hi there. Hi there. Well, do you know what? I have to tell you that actually the furry babies, they really love to, they really love to get dressed. And actually, do you know what? Let me, uh, let, I'm going yeah, to. Yeah, you see, my... Denise Lucas is saying, I see her comment. She likes to bling <laughs> it up. Don't, yeah. the boys are getting, the boys are gaining. I'm sure that many people could say, and Leslie could probably speak to this, Bobby, too, that in the beginning, oh, yeah. see, there we go. Shout out yeah. to Danielle Purcell. In the beginning, it was boys rough. may not have been well represented. And yes. Leslie, you can speak to this better. But in recent years, I want to say things have definitely yes. changed. Yes, they have they look definitely, gorgeous, definitely gorgeous. changed. Gorgeous, gorgeous clothes. So, oh, don't, pretty. Yeah, yeah. Denise is saying that she doesn't spare any expense okay. with bling because it's for a boy. So designers are still representing for the boys. Mm -hmm. They're exactly. getting there. They're getting there. Yeah, yeah. So absolutely, pretty. absolutely. No, girls, boys, there. like look at this. This is one of my favorite. Like, yeah, that's adorable. A little bit, you know. It's like absolutely. Also, some of the ones <laughs> I bought. Like, look at this. You know. There you go. There are boys right there. Boys right there. Yes. Yep. Yep. And if you so want yes, your guy to say go that, they're coming. They're that. coming. Oh, shout out to <laughs> look, at the, look at the Schrager mm -hmm. boys. Yep. Yeah. So don't say the boys are on their way. Mm -hmm. or, or I should say they're here. They're, they're here. not they're on, their on their way. way they're yes. here. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Hey, look at Lilo. They're here. <laughs> like, so Definitely. amazing. Definitely. Don't get discouraged, friends. You know, it's like. <laughs> and uh, you never know. I mean, like one of our last events, Bobby couldn't make it. So Puccini went in drag. So yes, he got yeah. to wear a tutu. There you go. Yeah, we're all kinds of fun yeah. stuff. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, so there you it's, go. So it's a lot of fun. So it yes, we're trying to be more fun. gender fluid these days. You know? <laughs> yes. BPC. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I love it. And so, are you excited? Who is excited? Oh, ladies, yeah. you all can. Oh, yes. I'm excited. I'm yeah. excited. I'm yeah, excited. Oh, my God, friends, look at this t shirt. Celebrity yes, Catwalk. Celebrity Catwalk. See? Celebrity Catwalk t shirt. Beautiful. Blingy. Yes, exactly. I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> and then just you know, to clarify it again for people who are new to Celebrity Catwalk, this is the name of the charity organization and the name of the event is Pulse in the City. So just to, because even for me, I was like, ah, yeah, yeah. but then of <laughs> course, uh, you know, and you know, Pet Peak Story, it's like 
uh, right after we launched and we made it to top 10 in US podcast, my first podcast episode we launched was with Jennifer. And then everyone start asking, so Basia, are you coming here to post in the city? I'm like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> and then I came. He came and the rest is history. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And uh, any last tips, anything else, fr uh, friends and ladies you'd like to share with our uh, listeners and viewers? Yes, Leslie, yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I would like to have Jennifer do something for me because my cousin is coming and she's bringing her Australian beautiful blue-eyed shepherd. And mm -hmm. she is beautiful. She's a one-year-old puppy. But she asked me, so what are you doing each day and which day should I come? So oh, how should I answer her? That's a wonderful question. Okay. Yes. Well, if for people and if your cousin would like to uh, as they say, trod the boards, if we were in Broadway, if she would like a little taste of the catwalk. As, as you all know, on Friday, any ticket holder can, per and this is, this is a standing schedule. So if someone kind of goes, ah, pause in the city, what is this? I don't know if I'm gonna do this. This sounds, what, what a whole weekend, it sounds crazy. <laughs> yeah. On Friday night, any ticket holder, all you have to do is have a ticket. You mm -hmm. can participate in Friday's contest. The theme is always very wide open. The theme is always something that I, that I, I want it to be all inclusive. So the theme is holiday glam. And anyone who has a ticket can participate and hit the catwalk on that Friday night if they kind of want to test it out, you know, and kind of date us before we go steady, so to speak. <laughs> so fri but, but Friday is also a short night. It's only from, you know, six to nine o'clock. Mm. Saturday or sun and Sunday are the meat and potato days, if you will. There mm. are raffles every day. There are silent auctions every day. And we divide our designers into, we're actually going to show two designers on Friday in addition to the contest. But Saturday oh, cool. is really all day fashion show and Sunday is all day fashion show. And of course, there's it's a celebrity catwalk event. So there's food every day and um, there's raffles and auction items every day. But I like to tell people that if you would like a little bit, a little taste of the catwalk, you can participate on Friday. Whereas Saturday and Sunday, if you're not in the show, unfortunately, you cannot participate right so but you can that, sit uh, and be helpful. cheerleaders yes oh yes. absolutely you can yes. come and we love audience participation they can yes. make signs they can bring a cowbell <laughs> a tambourine <laughs> they can buy raffle tickets they can eat and drink as much as they want yes. absolutely mm -hmm. saturday and sunday are key days and then we top it all off on monday with a brunch again all ticket holders are welcome to attend and all anyone who attends the brunch is welcome to participate in that contest, which is graciously, uh, it was graciously the brainchild of Lynn Lena, uh, Avery Finn's mom and Aiden Yevez, New York Pet Fashion Show sponsors, but they joined forces and supplied the prizes for that event. Mm -hmm. And the contest is again, very open called Rep Your State. Oh, so, and anyone, it's a fun outdoor brunch. We eat, we have things to drink and anyone can participate in that contest as well. So I don't know what day does that, I don't know if that narrows it down. I probably didn't even answer your question, Leslie. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. everyone now has clarity uh, more you know on the layout because in the beginning like you only know okay those are the days but now mm. friends know better what exactly mm. to expect and, and i have to tell you may in a, uh, the question is not in new york the show now it's uh, in uh, south carolina yeah unfortunately and again leslie and bobby can speak to this <laughs> in new york space is an issue. Exactly. There you go. There you go. 
as these ladies can speak better than I can, <laughs> space is an issue. Even mm -hmm. in, even in, even pre-COVID, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. space mm -hmm. was an issue. Now, I think I would probably be put in jail if I put everyone in a space. I can't, the oh. bottom line is I cannot socially distance. Mm -hmm. I cannot ensure people's safety at a New York venue mm -hmm. that I can, that we can afford. Yes. In South Carolina, I can tell you, I can, I can be, we can do it safer. I can mm -hmm. space people out. You're not on top of each other. Mm -hmm. You're mm -hmm. not literally kissing your neighbor. You have space, <laughs> That's good. you have room. And if you wanted to, if you don't even like the entire ballroom that we're in, as you all know, mm -hmm. there are other rooms. Mm -hmm. You could oh, literally wow. sequester yourself mm -hmm. in a whole other room if you so chose to do so. <laughs> and unfortunately, I don't have the means to do that in New York City. Mm -hmm. Yes. So of course I'm I miss, you know, New York is is home. And I, I'm not gonna say never, you know, you never mm -hmm. say never. We may eventually return to New York, but mm -hmm. for the next couple of years, mm -hmm. we are in Spartanburg, South Carolina at, Brooklyn, at the same venue. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, thank you because here are questions. So thank you. Uh, you know, so it's uh, in Spartanburg. And then people were asking if in the future you're considering, again, you said that, that you would love to be back in New York, but you know, if there are in any other city like New Jersey. Maybe, maybe 2024. Mm -hmm. Okay. If yeah. for those who are asking, maybe 2024, we mm -hmm. might revisit New York, but I have signed contracts with the, mm -hmm. here's a little T. I have signed contracts with the venue through 2023. Mm -hmm. okay. So oh. we are we are locked into Spartanburg at least until 2024. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you gotta come to Spartanburg. And and I think that once you see the space, it'll all yes. kind of click. You yeah. all will see again. I don't I couldn't duplicate this venue in New York. I don't you even know of where a venue no, nope. there isn't. Know. There's nowhere. There's nowhere. Nowhere. Javit Center. Yeah. yeah. Javits Center. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, that would be it. Yeah, yeah, that's about it. Yeah. Yeah. And it's friends. It's like it truly it's a vacation. So yeah. in my case, and again, everyone, uh, you know, everyone, it's like uh, we get busy. Well, I have five years old daughter and a full time business. Mine is at Pix, which is full time as well. And if you just this is the time to say I love everyone. Let's have fun. <laughs> Take your babies. What is really nice, I can't describe it, but I fell so much in love with South Carolina that I actually went on vacation there. So it's <laughs> a kind of our new favorite place for my husband and I and our daughter to go on vacation. And what is really lovely, and then I will answer the question, yes. What is really lovely is that you have the hotel, which is really very nice and modern, and you walk, practically you go back from the parking lot, and then you go in your hotel to sleep. Mm -hmm. So you don't need the car. You can probably just get again a Uber and get mm -hmm. safety comes first. Everyone has a different, you know, uh, you know, knows what works the best for them. I mean, I drove mm -hmm. nine and a half hours, which on my way back was ten and a half hours from Florida. And mm -hmm. I'm reading here, you know, the the Grim Sisters, who it's uh, you know my very dear friend. I met her in person. She says that it's a really nice venue. Uh, and then here the question when it is, can you please give quick recap of, you know, of the brunch and everything? Well, here it's Jennifer. It's your turn, Jennifer. <laughs> you know, quick recap. Oh, quick recap. Oh, okay. Absolutely. Come on, join us. Pause in the city, Spartanburg, South Carolina. We're going to be in Spartanburg for the next several years because I, as you all know, we have to ensure safety. We have to ensure a, a good space. Uh, like Bossy said, you don't need a car once you get to the compound, if you will. There's food, there's hotel, lodging, everything is right there. So uh, for the next couple of years, you gotta come on down to Spartanburg, South Carolina. If you wanna hit the catwalk for charity, you gotta come on down and uh, We'd love to have you. And as you know, as we said, registration is happening now for May of 2022 and registration will end next month. It will end in November for May of 2022.
Yeah, it's uh, practically friends November 12th, 13th and 14th of this year, which practically it's almost here. And I and I have here a question. What is the major thing you look at when you pick, uh, you know, furry babies? Well, so for you can right now go there uh, to be just as a guest. And then if you'd like to be a model, are there any special criteria you look for, Jennifer, for the models? No, just that we want, I, I think everyone knows that we, we, the main criteria that we look for is we want your fur babies to be comfortable in clothes. I'll never forget a fashion show I went to many, many years ago uh, in New York and the dogs were seemed very uncomfortable in the clothes and it was almost like they were in pain. We don't want that. So we really want your dog to enjoy. I have moms and dads who say when they pull out the dresses, when they pull out the clothes, the dogs like light up like they know I'm going someplace or I know mm -hmm. something is happening. Yep. So we want you to be able to enjoy it. Reach out to me. I'm Celebrity Catwalk on Instagram. I'm Jennifer Bartok on or Jennifer Bartok Taylor on Facebook, and we can talk about it. If you want to register for May, ah, there's Puccini. We yeah. can absolutely discuss it. There are loads of videos and pictures that you can see. Talk to the models. You know, yeah. I'm of course going to be, I'm going to be biased. I'm going to be a very biased representative. These ladies will give you the skinny. They will give you the lowdown. Mm -hmm. At this point, I think everyone knows someone or knows someone who knows someone who has mm -hmm. done pause in the city. Mm -hmm. And they can really speak to, you know, what it is about. And they can give you an unbiased opinion. And they can tell you about all the changing and backstage. Like both of these mm -hmm. ladies, they can share some of their hacks, their model hacks on what they do to stay sane backstage. <laughs> but yes, there you go. They can really speak to accessorizing. But definitely, I of course, I think it's fantastic. It's one of a kind. It's the only five day pet charity event happening mm -hmm. right now. I'm giving you Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. No one else is doing that. So I'm very proud of that. I'm feeding you every day. So I'm very proud of that. So it's, um, you know, I think it's a good event, but definitely talk to a model. And when you're ready to register, we can get you signed up. But um, I, I think it's an incredible uh, testament to the designers, to the models. These ladies have been a glutton for a punishment for almost <laughs> 10 years. So, you know, they, 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 they must be masochists. They keep coming back. They like the pain. They like the pain <laughs> of, of participating. Yes, okay. By the way, can I just uh, ask, people were asking, uh, is it Southern food? What type of food it is? Because truly I was so busy. I only mm -hmm. remember that my oh. friend who helped me, uh, she had little plates for me, but I was so in the moment, I don't even remember what I had, but I remember it was very tasty. So the venue caters the food on Thursday for the early bird reception. The venue will cater the food. I always like to have at least one vegetarian like option. So we will have crudite, hummus, artichoke dip, but then there'll also be for our carnivores, there'll be meatballs, there'll be chicken satay. There'll be, there'll, there'll be chicken wings, there'll be shrimp cocktail, there'll be brisket, there'll be turkey, there'll be ham, there'll be macaroni, it is the South, so there will be macaroni and cheese, there will be, there you go, there you go, so there is, there is, uh, I think I just added, there's brisket on one day. There is an apple phyllo, but, but don't, no one has to worry. I am not doing the cooking. Most important thing to know <laughs> that I am not cooking. So Ooh. everything is edible and made by <laughs> professionals, not me. So that is what is important is yeah. that I, the food is catered buy the venue on two or three nights and we bring in an outside caterer the other days. Mm. 
Does that help? Does that answer the question? Is that good? <laughs> mom, just thank you for those emojis. Oh my God, the cute emojis, like, you know. <laughs> Is that good? I'm starting to cook now. For the people wanted to know, I'm yeah, starting right. to slave over a hot stove now. <laughs> Listen, listen, you're so cute. Like Jennifer, it's so busy with helping and organizing everything. You don't even have time to sleep those few I'm going to cook. I'm starting. I'm putting stuff in the oven now. She hasn't and, even had uh, time to buy toilet paper. Bring the, toilet paper, people. Oh, yes, Beth. You got to bring, bring, bring BYOT. Bring yes. BYO, BYOT. Right. Bring yeah. your own toilet paper. No, I think we should have toilet paper. <laughs> okay. There isn't a shortage yet, is there? Is it, no, I toilet paper? Is it is it where it's happening again. Is it happening? That's oh, what I better stock, stock up. Too. Yeah, stock up on <laughs> Okay, yeah, we don't want to have a toilet paper. <laughs> right, that baby. would be hilarious. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, that's hilarious. Uh, uh, so can I just ask here, Sophia, where do you live? Because Sophia, she's uh, joking. She's saying casco in her city they have you know casting for the way i live they have and by the way also friends i just want to uh share with you save the day next week november 2nd november 2nd at 5 30 easter time which is uh 2 30 pacific time we are going to have the last uh, post in the city preview live before the event of course afterwards we'll have a recap hopefully someone oh my god hopefully someone there will be streaming live hopefully you know pet pics can share and ladies send. yes if you want those yeah. that job ladies we're currently looking to fill that position so yep. you all have nothing else to do yes <laughs> and i can even give you pet pics the access so you can share to pet pigs because, you know. You have uh, nothing else going yeah. on. You guys got nothing else to do that weekend. Yeah. You'll be like changing outfits. Yes, yes. Outfits. you'll be like, wait, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jennifer, right. get oh, that right. camera off my face. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh my God, so cute. You have and then nothing I else get... to do, ladies. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so we're looking for volunteers. So if you Bossy want to. Volunteer... is looking for correspondence. So I'll yeah. be sure to give her your name. <laughs> yeah, yeah, DM us here because, you know, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able physically to come because a lot of you have been asking me. Unfortunately, I cannot come, but next year it's a date. Mm -hmm. Next year we'll be streaming live. I will be taking pictures, whatever else. By then, Pet Pix will come up with and crazy Basi. Uh, so if Basi you will be right there in your face, so you won't <laughs> be able to run. Yeah, exactly, exactly. And uh, by the way, we have people here for Queens and they're joking, so I love it. Uh, I just saw so really so cute. Uh, but yeah, so friends, stay tuned next week again. Uh, it's November 2nd, 5.30 p.m. Easter time, which is 2.30 p.m. Pacific time, the same way in Celebrity Catwalk uh, Facebook page. We are going to have the last uh, amazing wrap-up uh, you know, a kind of uh, get together preview. We have incredible uh, friends, of course, in the city supporters who are coming as well. Mm -hmm. uh, so you don't want to miss this one. As you can see, we have a lot of fun, but I really, really want to thank you, ladies, and all of your friends who are currently watching live watching the replay, listening this again on Fat Peaks Academy uh, podcast on Spotify, Apple, uh, Apple Music and Pandora and etc. So just thank you because again, this is how we have fun. You know, nowadays we know we want to meet, which all of you will meet very soon in person. It just, this is a new way of really being able to hang out with friends and just have a lot of joy and fun and maybe consider the opportunity to have your babies you know, being on the runway for 2023 <laughs> May, because I will have, I would love to meet a lot of you if I don't know you yet in person, to meet you in person. You know, Jennifer, it's amazing. Bobby, That's right. Bossy's going to be there in May. So everyone has to be there to get the, get the scoop. <laughs> oh, oh my God, Leslie, you're adorable. Last <laughs> words, anything else, ladies, anyone wants to say? See you in South Carolina. I love it. Yeah. Thank you. Sounds good. Yeah. Come on down. I love it. I love it. It's just so incredible. Thank you very much for Thank making you. Thank my you. night Thank so you. spectacular. I'm so excited. I cannot tell you the joy to be part of, you know, Celebrity Catwalk family. It's just like, 
you in a great way changed my life. And I know that a lot of furry parents need, <laughs> even if you don't know <laughs> it, friends, it's one of, an, one of a kind type of experience. I cannot express it with words. You have to just come and join us. And thank you as well to everyone sending me tons of love. Thank you for sticking out with us. Apparently, we kind of, we just love to hang out. That's it. I, I will leave it like that. Enjoy your evening. I will see you soon. Save the day again, November 2nd, 5.30 p.m. Easter time, 2.30 p.m. Pacific time, Celebrity Catwalk. Facebook page. Of course, Pet Picks will be sharing. Everyone will be sharing. We have great people who are coming to share with us, also teach us a lot. Uh, again, goodies and information. Uh, and just consider, you know, you can still come, you can still join, and you can have your babies as model next year. Let's have fun, give back, and enjoy great memories. I will see you soon. Thank you so much, everyone. Bye-bye, friends. Bye. Bye.